talk. It's time to talk. It's time to talk. We got some problems here. Each wave leaves its mark on the shore. So goes the story of Cleveland's people. Since the 18th century, the city has been built through the sweat, sacrifices, and successes of a native people and immigrants and migrants who always believe this could be the best location in the nation. Distinguished by culture, tongues, religion, and always by race. The same river and bridges that divided us brought us together at times. I have my bread and bologna. Historic milestones and first and new traditions would continue to cement the city's place in history. Other events, their images captured frame by frame in black and white to high definition color would be seared into our memories. We have clashed, cried out, come together and come apart. seeking answers to the same questions. While at the same time, just a stone's throw away, in stone, marble, and granite, engraved in English and our other languages, are the reminders of who we really are, why we all came here, and why we stay. People are interested in Cleveland. They're watching what we're doing now, and they're going to watch what we do next. The elephant in the room is that we need to talk. We need to talk about our own experiences of race. We need to talk about our own wounds of race. I think we have a race relations problem in Cleveland, but I don't think we're any different from any other city, community uh, across the U.S. It's the foundation of a lot of our challenges. People are afraid to talk about race because they are afraid to offend. They're afraid that their own beliefs might be exposed. We all have unconscious bias. Have those conversations with people who don't necessarily look like us, who don't necessarily live next door to us, aren't part of my family, aren't part of my, um, my inner circle. We cannot talk our way to change, but we can start conversations so that we can identify what our challenges are and then we can begin to act. People just need to be open um, and have, uh, you know, what I call hope that there can be change. Some icebreakers to get people talking really are based on uh, just conversation, uh, uh, stories that can be told, dreams, hopes, and aspirations. This was the place where um, the migration happened. This was the place of the strong black middle class. This was the place of the thriving Jewish community. This was the place in which people came together. I mean, you had a melting pot. You, and you still see that today, all of these neighborhoods. I think talk can lead to action, but it also requires a commitment and a desire to change, change attitudes, change hearts, change approaches and continue to be inclusive of everybody in the conversation. When families talk together about multicultural issues, about differences in people's skin color or where they're from, it's incredibly impactful on a young person's life. If I can just teach my children to uh, learn and to be open and to um, uh, see others as um, in the image of God that, you know, it's not about what race they are. The YWCA is just one piece of the puzzle that makes up the greater Cleveland area. 
we want to do our part like everyone else is doing to make sure that Cleveland is the greatest place to live. Where else are you bringing together grassroots organizations with foundations and corporations and businesses and faith-based organizations? Once those conversations happen, we realize that we're not so different after all. We fail together and we're going to succeed together. I think we are arriving at a place um, historically in which um, you know, the, the power of yes and the power of hope and the power of change is in our hands. The YWCA Greater Cleveland, eliminating racism, empowering women. We can make change happen together and we can do it now. And it all starts with us realizing it's time to talk. Not only in Cleveland, but across the nation. Why do we have to wait for a horrific event to happen before we say, hey, let's make a change? Why don't we act now? Let's make a change. Stop talking about it and be about it. It's time to talk. It's time to talk now. It's, it's time, time to talk. talk. I think we need to do some talking. Cleveland, it's time to talk. How about a little listening, too? Could you all start... Talking.